Welcome to Date with Danu, right here on Hi TV, your luxury channel. Today on the show, we are talking about fashion, friends, and people who are not so friendly with the brand anymore. Let's speak more about it, of course, as we move on with the show. Hi, I'm Jennifer, and I'm about to go on a date with Danu. So I'm doing this show because I'm forced to do this. I don't want to go on a date with Danu, but here I am. Hey, I'm Ranshan. Hi, I'm Johan. And we're yeah, on a date, date with Danu. Danu. This is my fifth time on this show. I think Danu can't get enough of me. So for me, the second time, uh, the first one went really well. So let's see what we have yeah. this time. Yeah. Welcome back. So let me just introduce my guest for the day. We have Jennifer here, who is the founder of the brand Will by Zach. Then we have Johan, uh, who masters fit. He's just unwantedly energetic and <laughs> this is really annoying. Then we have Ranshan, who is somebody who I can relate to most of the time. Thanks, Ranshan. Pleasure. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, to be very fair, uh, none of the women who Jennifer asked to join her on the show agreed. They all just said no to her. Understandable. Why, why don't the women, why don't the female generation like you? This is your opinion, Danu. I don't, they, like no, they had pre-commitments. <laughs> far from it, they all just said that we have signed contracts, we have to go. Like, oh, but the men were okay. <laughs> oh, we love you. Yeah, we're, love you. Yeah. we're there, don't worry. You, re you. really reconsider, don't make yeah. any clothes I'm just women. making a men's brand. <laughs> yeah. 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 Just, just, two men's, just two men's linen shirts, that's, that's about it. So, uh, let's start off with Jennifer. So, you are not here anymore. You are one of those people who left our country and went. But yet, you still love this country. Of course, Sri Lanka is home. Just the way I put it, <laughs> like just threw her under the bus. I know, but I had to start from somewhere. Yeah. So, I started with home. Uh, so, yeah, I had to move out because um, of my son, Isaac. And... Um, he refused to just, study here. Yeah, so, he was struggling with the Sinhala language okay. and various other things. So, so that's the reason why we decided to move away from Sri Lanka. Uh, and how, how is life there? Good? Aussie life is good, uh, apart from the Melbourne weather, I must say. Hmm. Uh, but yeah, we've settled. We've, we're here most of the time. I know. I'm like here left. most of the time. Like, <laughs> yeah. Literally, I never left. But yeah, life is good, more stable, more, more, more balanced. It's a family work life balance very much. And yeah, we're happy. That's amazing. All right, so Johan, uh, last time you were on the show, he actually did Scott's, no. A plank. 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 Yeah. Me on top of him. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh. Nice. <laughs> I definitely enjoyed the ride. <laughs> <laughs> Just wanted to say. <laughs> Johan, ever since then, you have been still hopping, jumping, like climbing unwanted amount of boxes at the gym and like when have you ever decided like you just get tired you're like enough now um, that has been the passion so always will be doing the same thing over and over again but yeah, actually now I have uh, put my attention on another area that uh, which is totally opposite from the fit as well oh really what is so it? fitness I always say fitness is a lifestyle so I am planning to uh, open up a pub which goes oh. as Ceylon gentlemen so, so you work out and you come back? Come there and drink and again go back to the okay. gym. <laughs> Work-life work work life balance. balance. That's amazing. Okay, great. So that's, that's going to happen. So that's good. So that means you're not hopping and jumping these days. Uh, I'm like, hopping and jumping, definitely. Yeah. This one is like from here, like... <laughs> no, and then jump in between the gym and the bar. Ah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. Like, don't you ever feel tired? No, because I think if you do it every day, you don't feel yes, tired. Like, don't you have thing. days where you're like, I just can't today. Any human has to feel that? No. I, of course, to be honest, I haven't found a day that I have feel like, uh, no, not today. No, I haven't. If I didn't do it only, I feel like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> no, just not normal. <laughs> no. And like, when you go on trips and all, do you just jump around there as well? When I go on trips, I actually take my proper vacation because it's for myself. But you don't work out there? No, nothing. My God. It's just eating. Oh, what <laughs> I would like to meet you during those days. <laughs> <laughs> Ranchan, how are things these days? Fantastic. Just enjoying the kids. They're growing up way too fast and just enjoying that. And getting into different types of work. How old is the first? Busy. Sorry? How old is the first? Two and a half. Time? Kai is two and a half. Freya is one and a half. So... Interesting gaps there, kind of. Yeah. How do you keep tabs on COVID? 
when did we have it? <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's all about following Ranshan's baby calendar. Yeah. <laughs> one was a COVID baby, the next one was an economic crisis baby. So both times we were stuck at home. What do now? With nothing to do. <laughs> we have no place to go because there's no fuel. Okay, come, let's make a baby now. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Pretty Simple much. Simple as that. That's how you like move on with life. Yeah. All right, I think we are getting into our segment and it's called Hot Seat. Welcome back to the show. This is where we ask terrible questions and we look out for answers. We do have a gift bag from our friends at Crystal Luxury Wellness for the winner. All right, here we go. Uh, let me start with Johan because you are, you are in the middle. No, okay. Okay, people have been quite critical about your workout routine. What do you have to say to them? Uh, it depends on person to person, right? So I am a person who go beyond the limits. I always challenge myself and say, you know, today I'm going to do better than be before. So uh, someone can look at it in a way that this is crazy. Someone can look at it in a way, wow, this is, this is something amazing. So for me, being moving well or functional well is my more main goal rather than being very big or that's not my purpose. I just want to be functional. So doing this take me to a place where I can't even imagine that I, I, I can be. So, yeah. He used the word very big. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think you will find in Jennifer's bedroom? <laughs> very interesting question. <laughs> Definitely uh, there should be a, a bottle next to her bed. Easily. <laughs> Fitness connection, high octane, Zimantra. If not for fit, where would you go? Zimantra. If you had to part with one little secret about you, what would it be? Because this could save the world. Hmm. How can I answer that? Just uh, tell a secret. <laughs> secret? Actually, uh, I don't have any secrets. I always been very open about whatever I do, so there are no any secret in me, so yeah. Anything that happened in Candy, Trinity? <laughs> 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 Nothing has happened in Trinity or in Candy. Um, actually, I'm a very open person, so I talk what I do, so <laughs> nothing to hide, actually. <laughs> Definitely has something. <laughs> Out of the three who are seated on this set, who do you think will look the best if they had the perfect body? My good Lord. I think uh, both of them there good three, looking. I said, no? Is that him? <laughs> Her <laughs> and me. <laughs> All of them are really good looking. It's just that on their own ways. So it's very difficult to pinpoint. Anita, me who will look the best if they have the perfect body? <laughs> She's the only lady, so I'll say Jennifer definitely, yes. You know what does you know what that means, right? You don't have that body. <laughs> no, so the, the question was when you, if you have the perfect yeah. body, so none of us. That was a baited question. Yeah. That was like <laughs> Alright, Jennifer, it's to you now. Out of the three men seated around you, who do you think looks the best in a Will by Zach shirt? Oh, all three no, of us have this worn is, it at this some is point. Exactly. Yeah. This is extremely yeah. a tricky question. Because all of you have modeled, I mean, worn Will Bizak shirts. Just answer the question. <laughs> Who did you get onto the grid? Ranshan, were you First, on the grid? Yes, uh -huh. Ranshan was on the grid. Yes. Ranshan was the only person. Uh, and then Johan. Yeah, and okay, only I was not <laughs> on the grid. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'll make sure it happens today. So then no, all three no, are I on don't the want. grid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want charity cases. <laughs> Can I please know who who looked the best? So all three Ani, of just you look... Anita, the answer. <laughs> men answer the question. Okay, Danu, you look the best. No, that's just... <laughs> uh, I don't so want you that. wanted an answer. No, you no, can't no, say I'm satisfied with it. No, no. So I gave it Okay, out of the two who were on the grid, who looks the best? <laughs> so <laughs> into another level. Oh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> so... Pull the band it up. Choose one. Come it's okay. On. They're not going to get upset. <laughs> so I've actually worked with Ranshan first. Oh. So I would go with Ranshan then. There we Sorry, go. You <laughs> Name one thing that makes you feel sexy. 
My smile. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. <laughs> if you wake up one morning and found out that you had turned into Pushpika, what would you do? <laughs> Leave the show. <laughs> Leave much of this show. No, you're not going to be Pushpika and see that. You know, you've woken up one day. Oh. Keep away from controversy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what is the meanest thing someone has ever said about your brand? Oh. Nobody has actually been mean. Like, but the most like negative comment that I've got in a positive way is that you're constantly out of stock. Um, you don't have sizes. You know, that's one of the comments that I get very often. One message you would like to give to the people who may think you're not sexy? <laughs> I have to think hard at these questions, Dhanu. She's too <laughs> humble, man. <laughs> She's too... <laughs> Only in front of the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, sexy is in the eyes of the, of the person who's looking at me and judging me. I mean, you can look at me and find me not sexy. I mean, I don't have a problem with that. I find myself se se sexy. <laughs> Right then. Ranshan. <laughs> yes. If you were to act out an intimate scene with someone, who from the following would you choose? Ranjan Ramanaika, Basil Rajapaksa, Nyanaka, or Tarjani Sivalingam? The netball player. The oh, oh, right. What about you said Ranjan also, right? Ranjan is also there. Basil is also there. Yeah, Ranjan. Ranjan. He seems like a fun dude. Yeah, you'll have a good time. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> if you had. If you had a gen genie appear in front of you and he will grant you three wishes, what would they be? Wow. Uh, unlimited, unlimited funds to be the best golfer in the world. And three, for m people to be more compassionate. Just no world peace, none of those. Nah, no, nah, no, nah. No. Compassion will take us there. <laughs> no. Compassion will take us there. So yeah, even start your at the beginning. world's best golf player also will get you to the first one. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> odd. That, that is true. Yeah. But then unlimited funds means I don't really have to play when I don't Yeah, that's, that's true. <laughs> I'm just playing for fun. Answer this question carefully. Mm -hmm. If not date with Danu, what else? Like what else would it be called? Or I'm just, that's the question. If not date with Danu, then hmm, think very carefully. Hot tub with Danu. <laughs> I expected something like, <laughs> if not date with Danu, like what is life? If not date with Danu, I, why are we even I'm, existing? I'm reading between the lines. Danu. Okay. <laughs> a controversy you were alleged to be a part of that you wish you was true. Oh, a controversy that I was alleged to be a part, part of. of, which you wish it was true. Damn. None. <laughs> the only controversy that I was alleged to be a part of, I absolutely don't want to be part of it in, <laughs> in the first place. So. Okay. If you had to delete all but three apps on your phone, which ones would you choose to keep? WhatsApp, Instagram. And and the call app. Oh, that's just given on the phone. Yeah. Oh, you meant what I have to yeah. download? So Instagram, WhatsApp, and oh, my football fantasy app, the Premier League app. Fair yeah. enough. <laughs> Such thought-provoking answers, I must <laughs> say. But I must say, I think the only person who didn't complicate it and played it well was Johan. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fair. Uh, so I think I'm going to give this to Johan. So we're going to get into a break. We'll see you on the other side. Do stick around. It's a day good time. Welcome back to the show in conversation with Jennifer. Then we have the other two gentlemen who agreed to be on the show with her. <laughs> Johan and Ranshan. So, Jennifer, I'm going to speak to you. You are a familian, but not the familiar familian, the rural familian, right? That 
second. Yeah, she's yeah. not from Bamlavitia. The second tier so you family. Don't, you don't have to like highlight it. No, I just. Why are you uh, embarrassed about the fact that you're from no, Bamlavitia? No, I'm not. Then I'm why not. I'm not at all. It's just that you don't have to highlight it. No, I'm just saying you're a chameleon, but not from a Colombo address. Okay. Yeah. Tell me how was school. So school life was pretty good. Were you notorious? Yes, I was. <laughs> I don't put anything past you. <laughs> you so bullied was... the boys, didn't you? <laughs> like who who used to like come behind you? Like I just want to know. Like we know what happens in Colombo, like St. Peter's, Holy Family. Yeah, the Peter Rides were still after us, but we we didn't bother. At Not least I y'all. didn't. I didn't. Maybe the same I... uniform, we would have been fooled. Yeah, probably, <laughs> probably. <laughs> So, <laughs> you might have just taken the bus from Dehi to Bamblipiti and just stood in the bus. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just trust me, we weren't yeah. desperate. We weren't desperate. Ah, sorry, okay. we so, tell me how was life in school? So, school life was good actually, but I was like the typical tomboy, always up on trees in the walls. And my mom at some point eventually said, I'm not going to turn up for any of your parent teacher meetings because the, the, none of the teachers do discuss your academics, but they're always complaining to me. Were there but, academics? Yeah. You were a, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but I was a very. I never had. That's why. Like, no, but honestly, I was a very average student. I was in one, like one of those top three uh, students. But I was doing various things: drama, choir, uh, not so much of sports, but a lot of drama, and uh, choir and stuff like that. So again, into even planning, getting coordinating, and you know those kind of things. Oh, okay, so that From was school, all. Like, yeah, okay, it was all the like there. inter school drama competitions yes, and all. Yes. Yes. That's amazing. That's good. Um, what I wanted to speak to you about is from there, when you were in school, did you ever think that eventually you will land in 2020 on a brand called Will Bizak? Never. What were you into before? So as a child, I always... No, no, from child, you didn't imme immediately no. come to <laughs> Will Bizak or there was something that you did before? No, no. So as a child, I always dreamt of becoming a lawyer, right? <laughs> Obviously. Your Honor, there. <laughs> there. Oh, there. <laughs> Down there. <laughs> yes, what's up? <laughs> no, so then I started working. I studied, I started working, and then I continued my studies. Um, and then I was working in the garment trade. And then I met Tiran eventually at the age of 12. 20. <laughs> at the age of 20. And then we started dating at 21. And yeah. So from 20 to 21, you didn't give him a chance? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, so we were friends for a long time, obviously like... So you mean to say you friend zone him? Yeah, for friend one zone yeah. for a while. Because there was so much happening at the same time. <laughs> oh, wow. Wake You're up. juggling a lot. <laughs> that You're phase. juggling a lot like that. <laughs> Always. <Yeah. laughs> and then so, this so poor yeah, man the, agreed. No, he didn't agree. He proposed and yeah. So then we got married and that's how I came into the garment trade basically. Okay, marriage got you into it. Yeah, Tiran <laughs> happened. <laughs> <laughs> but why the journey to Will by Zach? Like what is the inspiration there? I do have a very important thing to talk to her about because the first time I met her, we sat in a corner at the shop and we cried as well. We had cried and bonded over everything and gone off life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, some of those shirts had like like tears stay <laughs> and like some gang combo I know as well like all over. But it was such an emotional day. But before we get to that, Will by Zach is inspired by your son? Yes, it is. So basically when because Tiran is in the garment trade and we wanted to set up something, we didn't want it to be a fast fashion brand basically. Uh, because you didn't have enough fabric to make it fast. <laughs> <laughs> Sustainable <laughs> fabric is supposed to be slow manufacturing, ah, sorry, sorry. so see, so it kind of right, makes right, sense yeah. in what we discuss. So, <laughs> so yeah, so then that's where Linen and the Will by Zach came about and that's how the brand actually started. Mm. But looking back at the brand, I didn't even imagine when, we, when, we, when I started it, looking back at it now, it, the brand has grown and blossomed and, and it's doing really well. Mm. That's amazing. That's good. Uh, Johan, I want to ask you, you recently campaigned for her and you modeled. Uh, how did she approach you? She slided into your DMs? I think uh, we <laughs> knew each other from back in days. So she used to come to us to work out. Not anymore now since she's in Australia. She's working out yeah. there. So 
But for me, Did I... Did she ask you for like pictures saying, I want to see your chest area and all that? <laughs> no, no, no. None no, of those. No, 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 no. We have seen all on Enough his, yeah, on his Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I use his profile for other things too. <laughs> <laughs> Reference, this is the body I want. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing else. <laughs> yeah. So, so it's... Have you uh, ever thought of that? There will be people using your... Uh, no, I haven't. <laughs> now he has a mental picture for you to go back home. <laughs> <laughs> if I put the picture now, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so... So, uh, it was a... Uh, she asked me, uh, and I also wanted to model for her, because um, one of the things that uh, I always love to model for brands, uh, especially people that I know. So I want them to have a, a, a good sale and whatnot. So I always want to, I'm a person who always want to help someone. Mm. So it can't, it's always not monetary, mm. but that happiness, you won't be able to get it from uh, money. So for me, more Those than Those shirt that, fabrics are beautiful. I don't think I'll ever see exactly. them. Exactly. So I really love that. I really like the fabric and I really love the shirts. It's so comfortable for You me. brought enough to make only for Johan? <laughs> and for you, Dhanu. Uh, I don't know. I have never seen those sizes. They are take even longer to make. That's the best. That's a lot of sustainable. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sustainability. Yeah, I'm going into it. Really stretching it to another level. <laughs> Ranchan, I'm going to come back and speak to you. You're supposed to be on my side. I am, darling. Thanks. Come on. We're getting to a segment called Yes or No. Welcome back. So we have uh, some questions. Just be honest. Show the right side of the board. If y'all feel like y'all are not sure of it, y'all can hold the middle part of the board, like which I assume it's a maybe. And if y'all want to explain, I will ask y'all. All right, here we go. Do you have a habit that most people would find weird or taboo? Oh my God, now I want to know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, tell me. Let's start with you. Why me? What the hell? So you're right next to me. The partying. <laughs> that's not, that's not a, <laughs> okay, Trust me, everybody around me has a problem with it. <laughs> Isn't that you guys don't have a problem with it? Uh, Rancha? <laughs> a few. <laughs> I'd probably say the, the weirdest one is the way I eat. And back in the day, I used to love to make people feel squeamish. So I would actually like Eat, chew, spit the food out, squeeze it, yeah. eat it again. I've actually made seven people throw up at the dinner table. Why would you do that? I just love seeing people's reactions for, for different reasons. But yeah, that was one of the weirdest back ones. In the day. How back, weird. In the How day? back in the day? How back in the day? We're stealing your show. Not, not that far back. Oh. So you've evolved. Uh, uh, <laughs> not, now, now I just make love to the food, so it's, it's different. Oh, yeah. So there's another one. <laughs> there's another one. There's yeah. another one. Johan? So I have this habit uh, where I eat peanuts with everything. I, even like a sandwich, I put peanut, peanuts. Like crunchy like peanuts. Yeah, crunchy peanuts. On top. I understand. And everyone was like wondering, Johan, don't you have anything to eat? Like, come on, <laughs> what the hell? Like, but yeah, I agree, yeah. it's nice, no? Even it's with really rice, nice. it's nice. Danu yeah. just likes, Danu Big just likes nuts with everything. I know, yeah, right? I I'm, <laughs> I'm happy that someone is liking it. <laughs> no, part of that word, though. Danu likes a part of it. Part of it. He a just likes the nuts. Peanuts. Just peanuts. the nuts. <laughs> nuts part. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, you're stealing your show. <laughs> Thank God for the couch, otherwise you won't be seen. <laughs> Would you choose to save your child over your spouse if forced to make a decision? You can always produce more. No, exactly. That. <laughs> yeah, it's, that's a 50-50. I don't know. It's a tough, that's a tough. Have you ever done something that you regret? Are we elaborating on this? No. It's not, I mean, it's not crazy. Like, when you're in an argument and you say something, you don't mean like... I like that. Like of that. course, uh, I don't mind saying it, actually. Ah. So... Trusting people too much, I think. Ooh. That is not something I owe these. Yeah, y'all are just, he was, just he came into the, the board, y'all are more interesting. He was the dirty detail. Is it better to receive... <laughs> <laughs> that starts off Let great. Start. That There's starts off great. <laughs> Rephrase the question. <laughs> is it better to give than to receive? It's, is it better to give, give than to than receive? receive? Yes, 100%. 100%. 100%. 
in all what? forms of that question. In all, <laughs> all, <laughs> all forms of that question. In every, every corner. In every way. <laughs> <laughs> every nook and cranny. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take a moment there. <laughs> <laughs> Would you date someone who was best friends with your ex? Yes. Would you date someone best friends with yeah. your ex? Yes. I have no problem with that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Are you good in the mornings? Yeah, absolutely. We are morning people. Yeah. We are hundred percent morning. Yeah. I'm not. You are not. <laughs> what time do you go to work out? <laughs> <laughs> All right. We need to get More into a break. <laughs> I have so many levels of conversation I need to have do with the, during the time that we have this break. We'll see you later. <laughs> Welcome back to the show. Uh, we we have spoken about a lot of things now. Um, Ranshan, this obsession that you have with Spider-Man. Yes. Number one, that bodysuit really suits you. Like, you know, you need to... Because just imagine me in a Spider-Man thing. Yeah. You all might put me in an oven and bake me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wouldn't get into it if it didn't look good. So. Yeah, that's right. But you have the physique for it. Yeah. Like, you have always liked Spider-Man? Loved, since I was a kid, yeah. Okay. But the suit I got custom made in the UK with this guy I found on Instagram. So I got three suits made. So the last three movies... I have the suits Although for. all three different versions of it. Yes, correct. Okay. And see, I've never been the type of guy to be like super buff and yeah. neither is Spider-Man. Yeah, he's very he's, agile, very, yeah. you know, flexible. So Yeah, wanky kind of a guy. Exactly. Wanky. Yeah. yeah, definitely wanky. Because even recently I saw you jumping off your apartment somewhere. You know? Yeah, so uh, I was... Um, one of my good friends owns District 25, which they have the license for Marvel. So they sell all the toys here locally, Birkenstocks, Marvel, Hello. all that. Yeah. So, <laughs> so he was like, we have a promotion on Marvel and I need something with Spider-Man. I was like, the right guy. <laughs> you have me here. Yeah. yeah. So I put Do on the kit. Do they make suits for big Spider-Man? Yeah. So if you watch the new Spider-Man movie, there's like all sizes of Spider-Man. There's like hundreds of Spider-Man in the universe. So, and there's one that's like... Uh -huh. Half the suit comes up, they see a little bit of belly and he's just eating and he's like... Rrr. But he swings and he's got the same powers and... Right. Yeah, there's... There's hope for everyone. Yeah, there's You know why Spider-Man is not in Sri Lanka, no? He can only jump around in Kalpiti and that's it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> he has no other <laughs> call. saving people in... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, he's like... Uh, <laughs> I just had to run. <laughs> yeah, if something happens in Pili, they'll be like... Oh, he's in the house. He's in the house. He's in the house. He's in the He's going to go through a traumatic time. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> now, um, Johan, a lot of people do come to work out with you. And during COVID time, you had a lot of backlash as well. People were like, what is this insane place to go when everyone... <laughs> Nobody wanted to even touch somebody, you know, during COVID. <laughs> like, you can be dead on the road. They're like... <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, nobody touch anyone. So, at, and then this one is jumping, jumping, and jumping at fit. So the people were really talking about. How did you survive during those days? So we are uh, mainly we are body weight based uh, training programs. If somebody has a lot of body weight yeah. and they don't want to lift all of that, what can you do? So you don't want to lift actually. So no, basically they have it on their body weight. <laughs> yeah, you can't lift it on body weight. <laughs> no, but what we'll do is we will teach you the method of how to lift the body. <laughs> so we basically take it slow with them. And once from, I came and I felt like I was about to die. Like that, yeah. Next day I went thinking that if I go the next day, the day after I was I was pronounced dead. <laughs> yeah. the, the thing is, uh, he came on a Wednesday, which is a live oh, day yeah. session, and he yes. came on the Thursday. Oh, right. So, definitely. To be fair, I've died. also been only for one session. <laughs> but the I next died. day, I couldn't play golf, I couldn't move. And I was yeah. like, Leave I, that, I, I couldn't have a bubble I movement. Go <laughs> <laughs> I decided Continue. to like... You yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, 100%. 100%. Yeah, you feel yeah. really it feel has good. to it's be. It's all yeah. about, you know, being consistent. Yeah, with anything. Doing it. So, then you will see drastically, you will start changing then you will fall in love with it. So, uh, mm -hmm. it's addiction actually. Oh yeah, oh, yeah for sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. But how did you handle the whole COVID backlash? So, for me, I find um, uh, positivity through negativity. So, COVID being a negativity to the entire country or rather entire world. So, what I thought was, this is a time that a lot of people are at home and they are bored. 
So let me come up with something. So we started doing online challenge and we did the highest or the rather the biggest uh, virtual challenge in South Asia, online challenge. Wow. And uh, I think uh, we had uh, uh, almost 100% participation on those games and we, we boost at COVID even in the economic crisis actually mm -hmm. speaking because uh, whenever the crisis or something happened to the country or to the world, I find it to find positivity through that and creative, being creative with that and overcome the problem. So if there's a will, always there's a way, so. Cool, all right. We have a segment <laughs> that's made possible by our friends at MasterCard, they're on show with us, and especially if you want to go somewhere and it's a hassle sometimes to carry a wallet and just doesn't even go with your look at times, you know? You can't wear a Spider-Man bodysuit and carry a wallet somewhere. It's Actually, just not going to go. 100%. So you need to have a MasterCard in your hand. Let's get into our game and it's called Tap and Go. So thank you to our friends at MasterCard. You walk away with one of these gift boxes and they give a very cute card as well, you know? Ready, people? Here we go. What book holds the record for the fastest selling book in history? Fifty Shades of Grey, Lord of the Rings, The Hobbit, Harry Potter. Harry, Harry Potter. Potter. One point. <laughs> it's happening now, the game. <laughs> <laughs> so I was thinking, I was, I was stuck on Fifty Shades of Grey. So I like, oh, Fifty Shades of Grey. I tapped it before, I said Harry Potter before you give the answers and tapped it. Double point. How old was Queen Elizabeth II when she was crowned? 29, 22, 26, 27. 27. Well done. Uh, damn it. Which country gives a student the longest summer holidays? Switzerland, Netherlands, Spain, Italy. Switzerland. Switzerland. Wrong. Netherlands. Maybe Wrong. Netherlands. Yeah. Oh. Wrong. Spain. Italy. Italy. Oh. One, one. Nah. No, when you get lo no points, you get the ham you win. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> There's no involvement at all here. I'd rather just play the game with them. <laughs> How many colours are there in the rainbow? Seven. <laughs> so. I can't. Ranshan is beating me to it. I can't. You can't. You have to be quick on these things as well. <laughs> you have to be quick on these things. Which year was the original Jurassic Park released? 96. 91. 97. Oh, 91. Oh, 91. <laughs> I think Wrong. So. Wrong. Yeah. 94. 93. 94. 93? 91. 97. 93. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, Danny was born. Damn. But Ranshan, to be yes. fair, you're the one with two. Yes. Correct answers. <laughs> two. <laughs> two. <laughs> Don't laugh for two, Jenny. You didn't even take part in one. <laughs> I did. She didn't have two tries. Yeah. yeah. I tried. Well, I'm going to give this to you. It's too much to pass. Thank, Thank you. you to our friends at MasterCard. If you're planning on shopping anywhere or even saving the world and you're wearing a cape and you don't have a place to take your money along with you, no worries. MasterCard solves all those problems with a simple feature, tap and go. We're getting into a break. I think we'll see you on the other side. Do stick around. This is Jake and Dunn. You welcome back. Uh, so I wanted to speak about motherhood. It's, it's a tough place to be. Uh, but Jenny, you really wanted to have a child. Yes. And it was a hard task. Yes, it was. <laughs> Tell me about the process. It was, it was a challenge and you really sacrificed it. You didn't even care whether you made it alive. No, so basically, Danu, I mean, I love kids. Um, and then we were going through so much of like, I've literally done about four IVFs and about 24 IUIs. That's a lot. You never know, you might be producing at a rate now. <laughs> <laughs> You'll I might be. Yeah. <laughs> so like, like I traveled, did so much of treatment and I was only about 27, 28. Um, so yeah, I mean, and I remember one time going to a couple of doctors and them telling me to stop the treatment because I was so young. And my body's gone through so much of treatment, it could be really bad for me. But it's I showing just... now. You didn't know the colors of the rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> it's affected my yeah. eyesight, yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so I just changed the doctor, basically. I mean, And it worked? Yeah. 
Amazing. No, so I remember at one time they checked my blood and said that my DNA, there was uh, like deformities in my DNA so I couldn't produce kids. But I remember sitting at this prayer meeting one day and this pastor prophesying over me and saying I was going to have a baby. It didn't matter whether it was a girl or a boy, but he said it was going to be a boy and he gave me the name like six years, in, six years before. Wow. So I went home, I remember after the prayer meeting writing Zach's name. And it was given by him. Wow, that's yeah, amazing. Yeah, and I wrote it down and I kept it in my little jewelry box and Thiran didn't, he was clueless about the name. And when I was going to hospital, I gave him and I said, this is, this is what's going to be his. He's like, we're going to hospital, you're going to have the kid, what's the name? What are we going to yeah. name him? But you knew so, all along. I knew all along. Even for me, that's the same story, even for me. Like, yeah. uh, even for me, it was uh, predicted by the Prophet. So, and I never thought, because even Jesse went through a hard time and he mentioned the color to the hair, to the every, every single thing. I was like, wow. And then when you see them when in you real. See, and when you see actually it is what yeah. it is and you can't even predict like yeah, it's how can you do that like God in such a yeah. way have it's been amazing. Us. Yeah. I think the blessings that some of us take for granted is that is true. The, the fact that you hear these stories and for us it was like bang bang two you know yeah. without much yeah. effort yeah. and then so many of our friends are trying and they've been trying yeah. for years and it's I not know. really so you then think, wow, it is such a blessing that we were, you know, yeah, given to. Sure. And also, Very adapting quickly. is not an easy task in this country it, as well. No, it's it's such a yeah. big make it easy actually. Yeah. Because, because there are so many kids who who love to have a home, My and there are parents who are willing, willing to give to it. Take, exactly. Yeah, but rather than just dropping the kid into a garbage or anyone else, yeah. like. There are enough and enough parents who are willing yeah. to. Correct. So but the system is so system. difficult. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's a problem, I and mean, because of that, the the amount of paperwork, house. Of course, you need to double check of the family and all. Also, but there is a limit that you can push someone to go through it. But, uh, but all of you have like an element of faith that is very big. Mm -hmm. It is very much so. Yeah, For me, much. my life has changed drastically with God because I I came from nowhere to what I am today. Amen. It's very emotional, mm -hmm. but then again how it has been changed it's just it's amazing. what made you find spirituality in your life when i was lost when i was didn't had every nothing basically one voice one day came to me and said johan this is what you're going to happen and even from fit to even what i'm doing right now even we are we will be the first one of the first uh, fitness brands going as a franchise out of the country so even that to everything prophet prophesies over me and when you when it comes to reality and when you see in front of your eyes it's happening so you have to believe the god and it is given and only thing that he asked we are not doing it 100 percent but then again how much he love us and how much he he put us into place to get us in order so so in my life it has played a major role a major role but uh, i'm asking this because there's been a lot of negative highlight for uh, the church like yes. more new types of churches yes. that had and uh, particularly one person has been quite in the news yes. and i think you're also talking about yes, exactly. uh, prophet jerome yeah. uh, in terms of <clears throat> reality to what we read on the papers or see in media or even see online what would you say is the truth or the wrong or is is it predicted and portrayed wrong i think it's uh, predicted and portrayed wrong because one thing because i'm a person who always go there so but i have seen what he have done what he is capable of so for me in my heart i will always stand by him because uh, for me my life has changed my family's life has changed so i will always uh, choose prophet as my uh, spiritual father at any given time so for me because sometimes we we believe that our closest one will be with us but they are not but when you come to god he always stand by us he hold us from our back and put it into the right place and walk so sometimes they put us into a place where now you realize who you are and who you're surrounded with. So at that time, I think you realize it how important God is. So for me, um, I know for a fact because I was there on that particular day. 
So I still remember, I think it's just that a small, without listening to the entire conversation, you listen to only one part of the conversation and then you predicted things. So for me, I think it's the way people have portrayed was wrong. So mm -hmm. that's what I, as I, I'm thinking actually. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a, okay, a sticky city to be around. Yes. Yeah, unfortunately. Um, what is new for Will by Zach in the years to come? You have opened a branch in Aussie or you're taking your brand there? No, we, we've launched a the brand there, but it's an online store. Okay. But we are also looking at opening our store maybe next year. So that's something we're still trying to decide where because we are based in Melbourne. Uh, also managing would be easy, but then there is also a huge shortage of workers in You can take London. a few of us. <laughs> Yeah, I can be a store manager. Yeah. 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 I can be Will by Zach store manager Australia. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. He'll finally get his clothes. Yeah. 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 He's yeah. <laughs> you might not have anything to sell. <laughs> so yeah, that's something that we're working at. But there you'll have to make bigger sizes, right? Because you won't have crony ones like here. <laughs> okay. No, we can go with the same sizing. <laughs> oh, really? No, no, but the sizing does change a little bit. But uh, yeah, these are things that we are still looking at. Mm. Uh, we haven't launched the men's collection, Danu. I mean, honestly, it's just the women's. But yeah, we're hopefully next the year. The gender but that let you go. Yeah, yeah I the know. The shirt was really good. I think you should uh, expand Which on that as the well. Men's the men's shirts, yeah. Shirts. I yeah. really loved it. When I modeled, I felt like, OK, this shirt looks Yeah, so he good. was like giving me really good. I was like, give me an honest opinion. The yeah. staff is amazing. I Did she dress right every now. shirt on you and button you up individually? I was looking forward to it, but I wasn't there. <laughs> she was <laughs> 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 What a sad plight. Ranchan and I have modeled for shirts together. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Some of the photos we took, you I know, I know. Like, Either I was buttoning him or he was buttoning me. And or it, didn't make to, it didn't make it to the social media. No, no. we had a few that came. It was came. A buttoning, butt on butt, butt yeah. a lot of butt every, shirts. Every, yeah. yeah. Shirts. A lot of things to do with Everything yeah. butt. Everything <laughs> but but yeah. with modeling. It had a lot of, it had a lot of holes. <laughs> <laughs> we have a segment and it's called Kinky. Welcome back to the show and we have this very fabulous segment and it's called Kenke and it's made possible by our friends at Midnight Divas. I've seen you around there. Ooh, uh, they have some really good stuff. I'm going to buy there. <laughs> I know. They have some good stuff. Yeah, yeah. actually, I was surprised when I walked in last time. Oh, yeah. Rancha? Rancha? You haven't seen me there. Yeah, no. <laughs> Johan, I don't think you have time for these. Unfortunately, yeah, you're yeah. right. <laughs> you must be just bringing a dumbbell home. Today I brought this. Yeah. Do you use the shirt? <laughs> oh, look, I bought a bar. <laughs> the medicine ball, I mean, the, the, the ball always the works. The ball works, yeah. 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 That, you, have, you have bands. Come on, you're getting oh, yeah. 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 And also, you must be like, you know, let's, let's, you know get, let's get the cardio in as well at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Put yeah. the watch on. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, right, here we go. So each question is thrown to all of you. You all can answer, okay? What is the weirdest thing you have dreamt about doing with your partner? Weirdest? Ranchan is taking the initiative to answer first. Please go ahead. Weirdest? Uh, I would say like doing it while skydiving. Oh. Just imagine. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a bird. It's what just a bird. <laughs> just a bird. Carpet cup neck. And then you'll see Ranchan landing. Johan? Weirdest. Hmm. I think I can relate it to that. Huh? <laughs> It'll be weird. That is weird to yeah. do. It's just extreme, right? Yeah, yeah. that is not a level extreme. Yeah. <laughs> I think the same thing actually. Huh? Skydiving will be <laughs> very weird. I better carry an umbrella with me. <laughs> uh, you, dear. Dear. <laughs> when I have have to be nice be. because I want. <laughs> no, no, you tell. It's okay. Your husband knows. You know that you're a bit off. <laughs> <laughs> tell so. No, so the weird thing for me would be making out in public. Oh, really? Just yeah. making out in public? Yeah. I mean, not 
but oh, in like, a public oh. place. Oh, oh yeah. like okay, okay. like in the middle of a mall or something, just go at it. Not in front of everyone, but you know where the risk is there. I don't Ooh, know. She's, she's saying like makeup. the police coming. <laughs> make up, but she really means Mons completely. Yeah, 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 like the whole Titanic swipe yeah. down and all. Like in a dressing room. Yeah, hand yeah, hand going down and all. Yeah. No, you can just use your stove. You can just do it in the dressing room while the place yeah, is full. Yeah, yeah. 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 There you go. Oh. <laughs> what are you best at in bed? Best at. Mm. Y'all can all answer, and we can get away with these questions really fast if y'all quickly answer. But we have to really think at this. But you, you know? don't know what you're best at in bed. We can't say it publicly. <laughs> mm. I'm best at sleeping. If nothing else happens to me. <laughs> That's easy. I can sleep That's anywhere. Easy. Yeah, we don't need a sleeping bed for that. Easy. Yeah, I don't need a bed for that. You don't need a bed for that. Right, darling. You continue. Tell. Just tell that you're good at in bed. <laughs> Full play. Okay, thank you, Ranchan. That was a good answer. Johan? <clears throat> Have to use my endurance. That's, that's the point. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. There you go. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'll go with Johan's answer. Not the, skip Ranchan. Have... No, skip Ranchan. Pointless, Rancha. you only having endurance. No, that poor man will be <laughs> pronounced <laughs> dead. Poor <laughs> 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 yeah. like dead. So you can't be so selfish. <laughs> I have to be. Satisfaction. <laughs> you have a few, finally, you have finally. A, you have a few self-care products too. Uh, self-care products. I don't yeah. think we were ever going to win yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she, she really needs it. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting joke break. <laughs> Welcome back. We have uh, done some digging on social media and we found a few pictures and I would like to know the stories behind it. So, start with this. Oh. <laughs> that's obviously you. So, that's like a really cute picture. That's me and my brother. My younger brother. You have the same face. I have the Still. same. I know. I have an age. Do you like no? to say about it? Like, do you remember when this was? Where? I really can't remember. I mean, I can't recall when this picture was taken. So I'm one of five in the family. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, so this, this is my younger brother. You were the fourth? I was the fourth, yeah. I am the fourth. <laughs> was <laughs> the fourth? Yeah, she's the fourth. Oh. oh my god. You're That's the one yeah. who they're carrying, right? Yes. Oh, cute. <laughs> You also have four siblings? Three siblings? Uh, two actually. Oh, then Who's there's the four kids. Still there? My cousin. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Give it to him. No, I can't be oh. just holding it on me. <laughs> yeah. Do you remember where this was in Candy? This was actually in my Candy old house, my uh, grandmother's house. Okay. Oh. It's been. We haven't seen that picture on social media. Oh. <laughs> How the eyes, man. Oh, that's your one. Yes. Photoshopped, clearly. One Photoshop because that time. Time. <laughs> the eyes haven't changed. Eyes haven't changed. Haven't changed. Yeah. Haven't changed. And fair as well. <laughs> and fair. <laughs> filter. Filter. <What>? Filter. <laughs> filter. 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 Was not filter. filter. Uh, that was uh, in Minneri, I think. When we went to see you the elephant. Pass, pass. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so you're still holding all that. So I, it's just, at, um, that's one of my favorite pictures with mom. You know, that was the time when we were all cool, so cool. Hell yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was my first year, no, third year in uni. Look at that picture. Look at that phone. <laughs> you should have seen under the shirt back then. Oh. Uh, oh. I've seen Man, like... There are, there no, are some. Yeah. Yeah. Online. Tuk, 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 yeah, tuk, yeah. Tuk. yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> Man, if I kept this phone, if I kept this phone, I'd make so much money today. Oh, really? This phone just sold for $90,000 in a box, like the first Apple iPhone. That's the first Oh, now one. it has gone to that vintage Ooh. one. Like, yeah. the guy who kept it in a box without opening it sold it for $90,000. But why would you keep it in a box for so long? Well, but it paid off. Me? He only paid like $300 for it. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's true. That's mad. Wow. I'm happy that you came out of this look. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> one of my uh, fattest time, actually. No, not the, no, the not hair. Bad. Not bad. The hair. No, no, no. The hair. What no, is the hair style? Very cheap cut. Let's see. <laughs> oh, yeah. Could you have a cheap cut, no, that is? The front goes like, oh it looks like God. it's receding. <laughs> the hairline. Totally. Johan, you always looked good. Yeah. <laughs> but not at this point. <laughs> oh, thug life. <laughs> Where you Shit. live the cool life and candy. Yeah. <laughs> one life, one life. Down the Dalada Dala Vidya. <laughs> How old were you there? Wait, which is your one? This is like uh, you, you 17 see, yeah. or 18. That Man. is the one this with the copy. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, you look so different. Where did you find, where, who were you with? That's mad. <laughs> oh, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. My the man who is going to suffocate is this. <laughs> <laughs> Endurance issues. <laughs> this is, that's the baby. That's the baby. Yeah. I think we were on our way, yeah. Tiran is in a Sri Lanka t-shirt, so we were on our way for a match. Ah, uh, okay. Nice. Somewhere. You're flying somewhere. Yeah, I think South Africa, England, I can't remember. <laughs> uh -huh. Wow, that's a nice picture. <laughs> this is uh, soon after or like? Yeah, this is uh, when baby was, I think, five months. And can you see the size of me? Yeah. Very <laughs> signs oh, of prosperity. Yeah. Prosper. <laughs> yeah, I was... Totally prosper. <laughs> You've lost how much since then? Yeah, I was 23 kilos overweight. Wow. Oh, <laughs> uh, my boy. Uh, <laughs> matching, uh, matching swimmers, uh, mum bought for us. <laughs> so cute. Such a roly poly. Yeah. yeah, he's he's he so smiles. much like me. It's crazy. He smiles. No, he's yeah. just oh good. my gosh. <laughs> I do, I do. Yeah. Thank you. Family vacation. Shit. <laughs> oh, yo, you're pretty. You're big there. Yeah, yeah. Was that the biggest <laughs> you've ever big. been? Yeah, I but went up to. There's nothing wrong with your body. I went up to 110 kilos. Yeah, I'm just 110. Trying to see. I'm just trying to see how you have made this so cool. All the other others the, in the element is like the yo, face, yeah, yeah the like, face, man. In <laughs> I'm in a suit. Let's see. Whose wedding was it? Was my one of my cousins' wedding. Yeah. <laughs> not long ago. Not long ago. That's a big picture. Very long, long, long what time is that? ago. Just a, is oh this your my accident? My second one, yeah. Second. You're holding <laughs> it the wrong way. You're, it's I'm supposed sorry, to be that, sorry. yeah, because we ended up in like a this house. This is the second one where you nearly died, was not this? No, that was when I was 15, sorry, 13. This was when I was, just before I went to uni. Long day, mm -hmm. I not drunk any alcohol, it was just really late, and I fell asleep at the wheel on the way home. Mm -hmm. Hit a lamp post, an electric post, eight feet of wall, and then ended up in that house like that on a mango tree. And the crazy thing was, right behind that tree, their three kids were sleeping and their bed was against that wall. Oh so if I went through oh that wall, gosh. it would have been a very different story. So again, two near-death experiences for myself mm. and for them that just, you know, we were saved. We got away with a scratch, the car was total. So all praise to God, just, you know, wow. my life changed twice. So yeah, that was very, very scary. Yeah, because you know, Drink and drive, I understand that. Yeah, like, but tired to drive stupid. is the worst. Yeah, yeah. yeah. because you don't. You being stupid, and you never underestimate how tired you are. You can exactly. Never sort of and I was actually at that. the Papillana Junction, just like stabbing myself, trying to keep myself awake, because we were only two minutes from home, and I oh, thought yes. I'd make just it there, just, just around yeah. the corner from the house. Yeah. Last year, oh September, you're like, oh, yeah, man, crazy. crazy. Wow. Properly, <laughs> two That's light post. Properly knocked. No. Yeah, and you, you had no... Wound. I just had a cut here. My brother had a cut from the seat belt. And that's it, yeah. Car was towed. Oh, yeah. They got hit before as well. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah the first accident, I still yeah. have a scar here. My brother had brain surgery. That was the crazy, crazy one. one. Yeah, and like, we should have died. No doubt about it, but we walked away. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. amazing. Blessed. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> So this is more mm. recent, right? Yeah. <laughs> this... I didn't give birth. You're the one who tells something yeah, about so it. Yeah, so this is, <laughs> this is the love of my life. Mm. Uh -huh. Yeah. Makes me skip a couple of heartbeats, not one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, but he's also my, my partner in crime. Like we do, we have a very open relationship. Right. We way talk about everything, yeah. literally everything. You're more of a friend. Yeah, I go out, for example, clubbing. I like 
whatever happens with my friends and maybe not all of it but i tell him he go he would ask like mama how was your night did you have fun mm, oh, that's oh. Amazing. you know um, awesome. you know so like he knows everything you think you would have had more fun with a girl um I don't know. I mean, I don't think I would have it any other way. I think you will. I think you are more mm, of a boy. Boy. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. most moms are yeah. like boy moms. Yeah. Correct. One day easier. Yeah. And, and he would always say, Ma, "Mama, I always want a girlfriend who's like a real tomboy." <laughs> uh, yeah, he says, "I don't like girls." I think well, that like is princess, pretty princess much normal. That's because you're not a princess. Yeah. Princess. yeah. 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 And they, also, they, I think. You'd be you a good mother-in-law. No? no, I would never be a good <laughs> mother-in-law. I would be so chilled. Yeah. I would like I'll keep yeah, the kids. Yeah, I can't do No, no, but I've told him I can't be this little grandma, grandma, typical grandma staying at home taking care of the kids while they go out partying. You have to tell me in advance. You also want to join? No, I just want to have go out and enjoy. I don't want to be, you know, like an. Grandma at home, stuck in the house. <laughs> right. Uh, on that note, I think we need to wrap things up. Right? This should, we are done with this show. We are done with this show. <laughs> uh, let's elaborate on that. Thank you so very much for coming, guys. Absolutely Thank a pleasure so having much. you Thank all. You. Uh, next time, Johan, when you come on the show, please don't waste wardrobe. Right? Yeah. <laughs> just wear the jacket. Just wear. Yeah. Oh. Less oh, is just always the more. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Less is always more. Uh, well, on that note, we need to wrap things up. Thank you so much for coming. Jenny, you know how much I love you, although you don't love me in return. I love you the most. I always tell you this. So don't just elaborate. You just have a great way of hiding it. Yeah, uh, I yeah. don't like to show people I love them. You know, they need to figure it out. Well, oh, I'm wow. sorry. I, 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 couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't do that at all. <laughs> that right then, on that note, we are going to say bye. Thank you for joining me on the show. Thank you, thank you. Thank we will see you soon. Till then, you keep smiling. Thank you.